What are you eating, birdie? You got all your snacks in there? So we put them a little picnic in the submarine today. I call it the submarine tunnel. Hi, everybody. Good afternoon. Hi, Nanette, Terry, Heather, Dora, Connie, Deb, Victoria, Jan. So they got a little bit of everything. Some spinach, some tomatoes, some almonds, some jacama, some apples. I think that's it for now, but they've had other things today too. But they can just eat out here while they want to, or when they want to. Hi, Jenny. Hi, Sue. Bear's got him an apple, I think. Hi, Shelly. Hi, Brenda. Yes, they had a little piece of a uh, quesadilla, Heather, Heather. All of them got a little square of the quesadilla. They got that from Chili's today. It was a chicken quesadilla. That's funny, Joanne. Hi, Penny. Lucy's up there on top of the thing, and Birdie's right there. Hi, Lisa. Oh, no, Lisa. I hope you get that fixed. Hi, Jennifer and Amber. They liked them. See, they've already been playing with the new balloons. She's asking about the new balloons. I got a video. I'll be posting. Hi, Sarcastic. Hi, Amy. Now he's got a tomato. Hi, Gail. Ooh, that sounds right in my eyes. Get on this side. Hi, Linda. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Donna. Hi, Samantha. It is one of the sweetest videos, Susan. We're all good today, Shelly. I hope you are too. Other than losing the first little balloon. <laughs> they did have quesadillas also too, Linda. Bear was just sitting in my lap, so it was easier to film at the moment. He didn't ride in my lap the whole time, just while he was eating. That's rooster eating. I think he's eating an apple or the chicama, one of the two. Or it might be a pear, Kevin said. Which one are you eating? You gonna run with it? Little stinker. Hi, Dennis or Denise. Hi, Chantel. They'll go to the trees. If we was to get cut off, because it's done that a couple of times, we don't know why, because everything looks good on our end, but if I get cut off, I'll get right back on, unless it's time to get off, and I'll, I'll say that before it actually is time to get off. So just watch for that. If we was to lose you, we'll hop back on. Bear and Lucy's already in the trees. She's at the top of the tree in the center of the screen. Lucy is. And then Bear, I hear him, but I don't see him. Oh, there he is, right here in this little tree. Liam. 
It would look cute, so to do that, I've actually thought about at least painting their names or something on it, but I hadn't done it yet. Yeah, the heat is pretty bad. Humidity. Valerie, hope you're feeling better. Amber, you wouldn't get to eat much. <laughs> you would be dying laughing if you tried to sit and eat a meal with them. Because they steal everything you got. Or spill everything you got. Hi, Kimberly. So Lucy to the right, bear to the left. Marcella, only about 10 foot up and very rare, but it has happened. Glad you found us, uh, Miss or Denise. Which one is it, male or female? You'll have to tell me so I'll quit saying it wrong. I don't see a picture on here. Hi, Carrie. Hi, Sandra. It is pretty here tonight. Hope everybody's having good weather and things are looking good on your end, too. Denise. Okay, thank you. Is that thunder? No, it's an airplane, isn't it? Yeah. I thought it's thunder there for a minute, but I don't really see clouds. Brenda says they've had lots of rain. Hi, Anna. How's the picture on here look today for everybody? Last night, everybody on Facebook said it looked great. Said it looked better than it ever has looked. So, hopefully y'all are seeing the same thing. Hi, Harris times two. Sometimes wind is okay, but not when it's stormy, Brenda. Good, Sandra. Good, Marcy. Yay, I'm glad if we just don't cut off today because it's so frustrating when you've got this many people on and especially like yesterday, I think we had almost 400 on and it cut off and then, then they don't know whether you get back on and it's just aggravating. Hi, Keldon. Rooster's trying to come see me. Good, Natalie. And good, Brenda. Uh, and I hope tomorrow's better at work. Maybe tomorrow will be a better day. Rooster. What are you doing? Huh? Hi, Judy. What are you doing? You gonna walk with me? They did get new balloons today, Sandy. While we was out, we stopped and got them some more. They had so much fun with the balloons. We still got two left over from the other time, but they're almost deflated too. Good, Chantel. I'm so glad. Finally. Kevin's down here picking up rocks. The rocks are driving him crazy out here. Since we've done all this new stuff down here, we had to look at his little pile right there. <laughs> They'll probably, he's picked up a million rocks. We put a bunch in our holes when we dug all the post holes, but we're still picking them up. I think they're breeding out here. <laughs> yeah, they're repopulating. Mm -hmm. That one's birdie. She seems like she always wants to have something in her mouth chewing on like a toothpick. She loves to have something in her mouth. He probably will steal them. Yeah, he better sure done got one. I yeah. Keldon, I did too. I was looking for things that had the little streamers like the cloud did. Anything that they could grab pretty good. And that was my only two selections today. So I just got two octopuses and one cloud. You no, know you're doing good, Marsha. I'm not good at it either, so we're in that together. That's Rooster up there hanging out on the post, just laying across it. Everything I've done pretty much has been a learning experience. 
other than just taking videos or pictures. Rooster's gonna jump. Good boy, Rooster. Good boy, Rooster. Go jump again. Do a big jump, Rooster. Go. Go, Rooster. Ready, set, go. <laughs> They're doing really good, uh, Shelly. They've had a big time today. I do too, so it's just talking him into doing it. <laughs> they like it when you entertain with them. <laughs> you didn't know you was part of the entertainment, did you? Sometimes, Kim, it's a great comparison because they've got so many, we've got so many arms and legs against us. They do, Sandra. I'm filming these two right now because the other two are up in the tree and you can't really see them good. And let's see. There's my birdie. There's my little birdie. Sue says much love to you, Kevin. But she wants to say you get with it tonight, Chasing. <laughs> I add a little in there. Can you tell me how? Let me go back up to a comment. Hang on. You better hang on, birdie. I can't hang on to you right now. Hi, Razzle. Yes, Sandra. Oh, um, definitely pray for the, the comment here that says the grandma hen. Pray for... Hang on. Pray for the Can Can Canadian wildfire workers' safety. We're not affected here in Tennessee, no. But yes, pray pray that it does rain for those people. See if she'll come to you, Kevin, because I can't use my can't do what I need to do with my other hand. She is a pretty girl, Shelly. Yeah, it'll happen, I promise you, Gail. If it doesn't, I'll be shocked. Still in my glasses. Hi, Joe. Razzle says they've had haze in Virginia, but it's not bad here. We didn't get anything the last time either. Yeah, now Austin, my middle son's in uh, Michigan, almost Canada, so they may be seeing some of it. He's on a fishing trip. Birdie's in the back at the where the house is going to be. See if you can get them two knuckleheads to come. Well, here comes one of them across the bridge right now. I've seen it moving. Bear. I see him now. Bear's in the center of the screen. <laughs> Lucy's right above us. Yeah, so I'm sure Austin is seeing it too then, Rachel. St. Clair, Lake St. Clair is where he's at. Yeah, he's at Lake St. Clair, Kevin says. Him and my father-in-law and our cousin nephew. and nephew are all up there.
Yeah, we didn't plan that, Sue, <laughs> but we are matching. I got my little camo dress on, and he's got his camo shirt on. He Actually, it's funny to him. He tries to match me a lot, especially for church. He does it just to be funny. I'll have on like a certain color, and he'll try to make sure he does it just because he thinks it's funny and tries to be cute. Hey, Rooster, what are you doing? Don't you, Kevin? <laughs> He'll just come out grinning from ear to ear because he thinks it's funny. She was five months old about, Kim. Right around five months old. Thank you. We're so glad she's here at our family, too. Thank you, Amber. Rooster, do you think this is appropriate? I don't think so, mister. Hmm. Joanne, she says she's north of Toronto and it's pretty bad there too. So yeah, hopefully y'all will get some rain and that will help from that. Prayers for that for sure. <clears throat> Bear was so excited over that quesadilla though. He just sit and talked and talked and talked and talked because cheese is one of his favorite things. But cheese and dairy stuff is hard on them. Can be hard on their stomach if they have it a lot. So we don't give it to him a lot, even though it's his, one of his favorite, favorite things. They love like cheese sticks from, from Sonic, stuff like that they love. So we do it, like if we buy cheese sticks, we'll give them each a half of one cheese stick. So that's two cheese sticks and they get a half, something like that. So we just give them limited things. Oh, that's sweet, Deanna. Lucy's in the tree, too. Uh, Anna, he weighed about nine ounces. Not about. He weighed exactly nine ounces. Rooster was sick a little bit when he came to us. He had Giardia, which is intestinal worms. We're lucky he didn't have more. But he was pretty sick for about three months before we could get him gaining weight or... Like, he didn't have hair like he was supposed to, anything. He was just, he couldn't get over that there for a little bit. He had some um, siblings that was with him at the time that I knew the people that had had them, and they actually lost one of theirs. So, that was the same, come from the same place. It was really sad. Yay, Julia. Glad somebody recommended it. Welcome to the page. So, Birdie and Bear have overall been healthy the whole time. Like, we've never had to really do anything to those two. They've been healthy from the beginning. But Rooster had trouble and Lucy had trouble. And people will still ask why Lucy's so little. But y'all know why Lucy's so little. She didn't, you know, she was malnutritioned at first. Plus, y'all see how hard she plays. So she's just, it's taken her a little while to catch up, although she's grown a lot. And she's definitely healthy. Ours are just very, very, very active. Good, Joe. I'm glad you, I hope you like it. Yes, Jeannie, we, on day one, like anything we wanted them to be comfortable with and used to, we started day one. Like the hair dryer, we started day one. Baths, we started day one. Uh, anything we wanted them to hopefully love. And that's why a lot of people will tell me, how do you get yours to do so well in the bathroom or the bathtub? Because theirs don't. Um, but that's a lot of the reason right there. Because we just done it every day pretty much at first and they just got used to it. And y'all saw how comfortable he was, and that was his very first day with us. Rooster's eating a tomato. We got to get out here and pressure wash this pad off because it's dirty. 
Hi, Angela. Yeah, that's the sad thing about these monkeys. A lot of them are sick. A lot of them don't make it. Just really in a lot of unfortunate things that goes on. A few people posted today thinking that the balloon was like saying that one of the monkeys had passed. And I'm like, no, 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 no. I said, if one of them had passed, I would not be on social media. At all. I wouldn't even be able to talk. Uh, once a year is about an, it's, it's sufficient, Sandra. Tammy, you would not believe how many people say that, but I'm so glad they help you. Thank you for saying that. Oh, we beat our record again. There's 107 on here tonight. Now we got to have a new record on here. Now we need to make it to 200. Thank you, Sandy. We leave, we have food out for them all day long, so they eat when they want to. Um, as far as monkey biscuits are left out all day long, water's left out all day long. Uh, things like what we've got out right now is left out all day long, like the spinach and stuff like that. And then other things is just extra, like, like here lately, I, I make their monkey chow with a bunch of fruits and vegetables and stuff too, blended. Rooster, <laughs> Rooster's getting his butt spanked for grabbing Kevin's beard this morning. Get you lickings, Rooster. <laughs> you getting a spanking? Uh, but I made peanut butter balls the other night for them, and that's mostly consisted of their monkey biscuits uh, powdered up. That's the base. And then uh, I put peanut butter, uh, yeah, a thing of oats. Let's see. Blueberries, cranberries. Yeah, and then uh, almonds and cashews. Look at Birdie walking. <laughs> she kills me how she holds her arms up. Uh, he's used to it, Rachel. It happens about every day, so it's not something... It's not funny to us when we get our hair pulled, but it's just something... They can't help it. Yeah, that's why y'all normally see my hair up and his head shaved, which he's always shaved his hair. That ain't why you keep your head shaved. He don't like his hair pulled, though. He's a big sissy when it comes to that. <laughs> or being pinched. He don't like to be pinched, either. They can have honey, Heather. So, I did... That's one thing I did forgot, forget. So, that honey would have been good to put in it, but then uh, I put apple... Unsweetened applesauce in it, too, to make it kind of looser, to not be so thick. That was the sweetener that I had in there. Something sweet for them. But honey would work, too. Sometimes we do those different, so so here lately, they haven't been having their monkey chow at night. They've been having those little peanut butter balls. They're on the go, and they're easy to warm up real quick. Pop it out of the refrigerator and just hand it to them, and they can eat like that, too. So we've got a lot of different ways that they eat, and um, like I said, have food left out all day long, Different, lots of different things. It does seem hazy or something, don't it, a little bit? Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it's just my glasses <laughs> from where they're scratched from the live last night. Did y'all see that? They scratched the middle part of them. I had I ordered two new pairs last night, but they won't be here till I think Monday. I think Rooster want another butt whooping. <laughs> He's showing it to you. Hold it. You getting a pankin, Rooster? Hmm. Are you getting a pankin? Have you been bad? He's crying. Oh. No, the hair pulling thing is just something a monkey's gonna do. Sometimes it is annoying and aggravating. 
but you can't be mad at them because they just that's what they do they grab things and they want to hang on to things they're not pulling my they're not pulling our hair to be mean they want us to play like they play hi darvin thank you 121 people on here Y'all must be telling you friends. We thank you if you are. Tell your friends to tell their friends to tell their friends. <laughs> and their mamas and daddies too. <laughs> I know, Sue, they've never pinched. No, they don't pinch at all. Thank you, Darvin. I appreciate that. Hi, Hi, Tina. Colleen, Bear was just here. Where did he go, Kevin? I don't know. Bear. Went back over there again. Hang on, listen, see if I hear him. Bear. Mm -hmm. I didn't hear him, but yeah, I know he's over here. Yeah, there he is. There he comes. He's coming. He was coming across the bridge. What, Mama? What are you doing, Bear? They want to know where you're at. Colleen, all monkeys will bite. Our monkeys do not usually bite, but they can, and we will get bit in, in time. And we have been bit, but it's not something that they normally do. But all monkeys will bite. Hi, Penny. Glad you made it. Hi, Vicky. Well, I think we've showed that a lot here lately. <laughs> Kevin, Kevin's wanting to be educational over here. He says we got new followers. We need to show them rooster's tail. So there you go. That's what a spider monkey tail looks like. So the last about eight inches has no hair. Almost looks like a snake. And, and is real rubbery. And they have full control all the way to the very, very tiny, tiny end of it. Like the little bitty end of it is trying to move right now. the worm. Boop. You gonna lift it, Rooster? Lift your tail. Super, super strong just in this little bitty section of his tail. And that's amazing and crazy. Mm. He says, what <laughs> the crap are y'all doing? <laughs> what was we doing, Rooster? And I really, truly, truly wished I had a tail. Mm. I'm being 100% honest. I so wished I had a tail. Are you sleepy? Hmm. Are you sleepy today? You'll wind up here in a minute and get wound up. <sighs> you posing? Oh, well, I'm glad you saw then, Sharon. We've showed it before, so I thought y'all might get tired of it. We've showed different things like that. You want to show them your hand? Maybe y'all have never seen their hands either. So we do have some new people on. So this is a spider monkey's hand. They do not have a thumb on their hands, but they do on their foot. Can I see your foot? Let me see your foot. Show them their foot and I'll film it. Look at that big old foot, it's a rooster. And their feet and their hands feel much like ours as far as how they, the soft pads of them. Rooster's was six, over six inches last time we measured it. Yeah, it was about six inches. We hadn't measured it. He's like, y'all just keep on massaging me. And their ears look just like ours. <laughs> My ear is not that hairy. <laughs> but they do look a lot like ours. He's a good model here. And show them their teeth. They see your teeth. Oh, goodness. Oh, he's ferocious. Such a ferocious monkey right here. I love you guys. <laughs> Anything else we want to show them? Let's look at your crazy hair. What about your crazy hair? You're famous for your hairdo, Rooster. You got a rocking hairdo. Thank you. <laughs> Rooster, you're being good tonight. Look at that little foot. You're being so good. Oh, he's rotten. 
he can be such a little stink and then he can be such a little sweet boy too. Definitely the boys are the biggest two troublemakers though. The most that give us the most mischief and the girls are just sweet and love. Uh oh, except for this. She just stole his glasses, but he got them from her. <laughs> Jan says you're awesome, Kevin. Oh, Lucy. Sweet Lucy. And another thing for any of y'all that are new while she's standing right there, hang on to her. Hang on to her so she don't run, so I can show them. So Lucy's booty here, to tell them apart, Lucy has all this white hair on her back. So that's how you know it's Lucy. Rooster's hair, where hers is, is all black. And Birdie's is red where hers is white. So hopefully that'll help y'all tell them apart. And the girls have the little dangly things. I know people asked us a lot about that. <laughs> Kevin's laughing. I get tons of messages about that. People say, that's not no girl. And I'll just tell them to look it up. But the girls do have the little dangly parts. Hubba, hubba. Kevin says hubba bubba. <laughs> So they can't help it. That's how God made them. Ain't that right, Lucy? So he'll most likely do it again when we go in the house. He does it every day now. It's just something he started, and now he does it all the time. His helicopter tail. There's Bear. Honestly, Julia, they all are. Rooster just has his mischievousness about him, but they all are super good uh, monkeys. Hmm. Well, she was hanging on by her tail. Uh, Colleen, no, they're all, they've all already had their surgeries, all four of them. We've done that around eight, nine months. Thank you, Razzle, for helping answer questions. That's right, Heather. The girls also, when they have diaper covers, have the ruffles on their booties too, and the boys don't have ruffles. I do try to match their covers here lately. He's eating spinach right now. And almonds. Rooster, you eating some spinach? Uh, Kim, he does. He bugs hunt. And he bug hunts while he's out here a lot. He enjoys doing that more than playing like the spiders. He's on a mission when he's out here for supper. That's what he sees a bug up there right now on top of the thing. He plays some too, though. But he definitely likes to hunt while he's out here. He's trying to get what's on top of that, that little black spot, if y'all can see it, right above him. You need to go on top, Bear. Go on top, it's on the top of it. Silly. <laughs> He's trying to get it, but he can't. Birdie got her a tomato. Stuff like the tomatoes, we try to give them outside because they make such a mess with them on the inside. They'll squeeze them and just, they'll be juices. Because we try to let them eat a lot of stuff by themselves. Unless it's just really messy. He, call, he caught it, but he dropped it, did it again. Mm -hmm. So Bear can catch when he wants to. Up, oh, he's about to go get his bug, though. He got on top, finally. Here, he's waiting on you. Ready, Bear? Look, Bear. He wants to jump, Kevin. He went up there, and then he come down and forgot about it. Up, oh, Heather said 131. Awesome, guys. Hi in Indonesia. I don't know how to pronounce your name, but hello. Uh oh, Kevin's must found him a grasshopper, I think. Where's it at? He didn't oh he didn't see it. Don't Ward, they do sometimes watch TV. We've showed them doing that, but we'll show that again in the future. But they do sometimes sit and watch TV. 
Oh, there he goes, bear. That wasn't a grasshopper, was it? Look at him. <laughs> He's like, come back here. <laughs> Where'd he go, bear? <gasps> you better go help him. Go help him find it. You walking? Oh, I love when he walks, too. No, the monkeys are not sad. Happiest little monkeys you ever could see. Uh, Colleen, the spider monkeys should be between 20, 30 pounds, and right now they're about 11, 12 pounds. Uh, and except for Lucy, she's a little bit less. And then Barry, of course, is just uh, right under five, but he'll get to about eight to 10 probably. We say 20 to 30. Ours may not ever get that big just because they are so active, but that's kind of the normal of what they should get. They called it again. Hang on just a second. Get it, so you ready? Oh, goodness. Hang on, Raz, while I'm trying to read. Yeah, I, I was trying to just do that. That's why I got quiet. <laughs> I was trying to figure out how to do that. Hang on. And I think I messed up. I think I just blocked or hid the comments. I'll figure it out afterwards. It's hard to do it while I'm doing this. I'll figure it out though. I'll take care of that. I just hid the comments for now though. Oh, Hillary, Hillary, we will pray for you and that hope that all that all goes well and is successful. Thank you, Access Country. Yeah, I don't listen to anybody that says that they are sad monkeys or not happy monkeys because we all know that's not true. They couldn't have it better even if they're way safer than it, than being in their own environment. Hi, Christina. I'm so thankful that all y'all are so kind to other followers too and actually care about what's going on in their life too and not just all the nonsense that goes into, on into the world. Thank you, Jan. Well, and Sue, a lot of them just want attention too. Or just call, or to just be a troublemaker, just to see the reactions they can get. Sandy, I blocked his comments. I'll have to block him permanently or him or her. I'm not sure who it was, but I'll block them permanently once I get off here. But I'll block the comments for now. I just hit the wrong button, I think. Either way, they can't comment, so that's good. There'll always be one or two of those come along. We'll just deal with it when they do. Because they ain't going to get me down. Oh, that's cool, Julia. Is that, would that be the three little rascals? Who, who would that be? Because I may know them. I'm just curious. Thank you, Valerie and Millie. Thank you, Shelly.
button. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, I know who you're talking about, Julia. And thank you, uh, Colleen, because that's the, that's the way I feel. If you can't look at what we're doing for them and see good and see happiness, then there's something wrong in your world, in my opinion. Not to say we do everything perfect or that we're perfect people by any means, but we're trying to give them the very best life possible. Our kids say better than they get, we gave them their lives. <laughs> better, better lives than we gave them. But they had really good lives too. That's true, Marcy. Oh, Joe said 152, and then I looked, and it says 157. Y'all are awesome. And when it says that, there's actually more people watching, but it's those those are the people that are actually on the YouTube app, I believe. I think that's how that works. Thank you, Sandra. Oh, I do, Sandy. Thank you, XX Country. You'll have to put me, tell me what your name is. If you'd rather me call you by your name, you may just be fine with me saying that. But either way, I'm fine with either way. He was still trying to get that bug. Now he's over here. I don't think it's just a spot on it may just be, yeah, and I think it's actually gone now. Ain't no telling what it was. Thank you, Sylvia. Uh, Cindy Lou Who, I wished I could say yes. Glad you're watching them, Evelyn. They're our buddies. Let's see. I saw another comment I was trying to answer. Hi, Carolyn. Hi, D and T. Uh, Cynthia, no, I have talked to her through email, but we've never met in person. That one's Birdie over to the right. Lucy right there in the top. Rooster's sitting right here. And here. Is over there. I thought I was going to have to tolerate him, but he's on that red pole over there. He acts like he saw something. Look at him backing down. What is it, Bear? Look at him. Where are you going, Rooster? Yeah, we love Kiki, too. I've also talked to her mom a lot. We would be fine with any of them coming and playing with us. We've said that and told them that, so they're aware of that. Rooster just jumped on me. Boy, you want to tell him hi up close and personal? Here. <gasps> There's everybody's rooster. There's everybody's little rooster, funny monkey. He's going to bite my shirt. Bite his hand. What are you doing? You're biting your own... Oh, and now look. He stole my glasses. See, he gets up there and has a plan every time. You better look at this one quick. This is a rare moment outside. Hang on. i got to try to get my glasses back. And then Lucy's getting some loving. I did get my glasses back that time. Thankfully. Little stinker. Hi, Walena. Uh, XX Country. I'm not sure that it was Kevin that knew he did. Oh, <laughs> she about done a flip up there. She says, how do we both become to love the monkeys? Kevin just loves me. <laughs> <laughs> so he likes to make me happy. Uh, and he goes along with most everything, which I do the same for him too. But... Um, 
it was really my dream and it's just he likes animals too so it just works out for both of us but the biggest thing is we love each other so that's why it works Tammy, that's Birdie that usually does that. And if she showed him, if he showed her his shirt right now, she'd probably come running because she loves to do it. He's the best. <laughs> well, Luna says, I have that dream, but my husband says, no way. Tell him he needs to talk to Kevin. <laughs> Colleen, we've been together, it'll be 26 years in September, so pretty much since we was 15 and 16, as far as officially dating, but even in the 6th and 8th grade, that's when he started asking me out, when I couldn't even say I had a boyfriend. So a long time. Thank you, Shelly. Uh, Brenda, it's September the 13th is our anniversary and our um, my birthday also. So we got married on my birthday. Best right there. <laughs> right in the center of the screen. <laughs> Good, Ann. I was wondering. I saw Sue's comments, so I was hoping it wasn't for everybody. Close, Hillary. That's awesome, Natalie. Let's see. I'm trying to read some. That's awesome, Colleen. Glad to hear all that. Yeah, Kevin's on break tonight. He ain't playing yet. Thank you, Marsha. I wondered, Razzle, how it looked on Facebook. Yeah, Razzle says it looks better from YouTube, the YouTube on TV instead of like the Facebook channel, I think, on, on TV. You know, see if Lucy wants to chase. Lucy, he's going to come get you. He's going to come get you. Oh, she's still, <laughs> do you see what she done? Grabbed him right off his head, first thing. Oh, and he got him back. He's gonna get you, Lucy. <laughs> Whoo, it's hot and muggy out here, I'm sweating. And today's not even the bad day. Oh. <laughs> They'll probably join in. Rooster's acting like he's going to join in now. They all like it. Yep, he's going to get involved. <laughs> It was hot here. What what was the temperature today? It was at 89, 90 today. Tomorrow is supposed to be hot. But it's still humid though. Real bad humidity. Yeah, 95 is definitely worse, but it's just humid. She can. She's so fast. Kim. Uh, June, we do dress them occasionally, not like, we don't dress them much. We only dress them when it's cold, like really cold. Although dress, the spiders don't mind clothes. Uh, Bear hates clothes, so we don't force them to do anything they don't want to do. Um, 
And that could change even for the spiders. Like when it gets cold again, since they've not had clothes on all summer, they may not want it at all this winter. So that could change at any time. But we usually don't, we don't want clothes on them necessarily ourselves. But sometimes when it's just really cold, we'll put stuff on them. Uh, or for special occasions, we'll put stuff on them, like holidays or something like that. But if it's to where they mind it, we don't force them to do it and we don't, um, we won't do it. Ooh, Heather says, Heather's, Heather's, they've been bad. She's, it's like 110, 105 where she's at. <laughs> They're being punished. No, I'm teasing. See ya, XX country. Arizona is a hot state. That's where Carter came from, so he's hoping he don't have to go back there when he comes back. He will for a minute just to get his house sold and moved out of, but he's hoping not permanently again. Uh, Beth, right now we don't. We don't have a lot of... Um, we have t-shirts and stuff like that. That's the only thing we've done pretty much for merchandise. That's just because they take up so much of our time that we can't be constantly doing things like that so we do it maybe three or four times a year as far as selling things um because that's all we can handle because it's just me and kevin <clears throat> no razzle she's staying here in in town here um she doesn't know anybody out there doesn't have any well lucy she just <laughs> she just missed her drop there her changeover um, she doesn't have any family or friends much out there at all. So she's coming back here while he's gone for a year. So Monday won't be a fun day, but we'll get through it. And then a year, year goes by, a year goes by fast. So. He's eating another tomato. Is it Nummy Bear? Yes. Is it so good? Hmm. We have a few, Sherry, when we can get somebody else to take a picture. I want to get some official ones made, maybe in the fall, by another photographer. Thank you, Razzle. Uh, XX Country will be having long sleeves, uh, hoodies, and sweatshirts probably start out in August. So it'll be the one time, it'll be August, you have to get them ordered and then we won't do it again probably till spring. It'll be a pre-order to where it's up for like two weeks. You can order during that two weeks uh, and then it'll be closed down. And that's like I said, just so we can manage it and get done in a reasonable amount of time and not be overwhelmed and having to stay so much time doing that instead of doing what we need to be doing with them. It has worked out really well though, the, the times that we've done it. It's really organized and we've got it done in a quick time. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> Kevin, now you need to be chasing her. She's on a roll. Hi, Belkis. <laughs> there goes Bear. Yes, Birdie. No, Birdie's not with me right now, but she's out here, Amy. She's just off in her own little world. Probably up in this tunnel still. I was just thinking the same thing. I hadn't had my eye on Birdie for a minute. Yeah, she was, she was in this tunnel the last time I seen her. And she still is. Right there she is. She's yawning, so she's tired. <laughs> I 
I think Lucy must eat uh, drink energy drinks, Belkis, because she is super fast. She's faster than all the others. She must be on a, she's a special forces monkey, is what we've determined. With her being the baby and can do everything better than they all do, she needs to be on the special forces team. <laughs> SEAL team. Birdie, you gonna come down? Yep, a ninja, Heather. He's still over here trying to pick up rocks. You're going to be picking up rocks till the end of time. Rooster's over there holding them. There goes Rooster walking in the background. <laughs> That seriously never gets old for me to see any of them walking. Where'd he go? I hear him, but I don't see him. On the other side. Well, I feel like probably most people think that killed him. But then there's some that just really want a t-shirt. Um, and we appreciate that too. I wanted t-shirts myself. So that's another reason. I've got several different colors. And now I've got to have several different long sleeves and hoodies for the winter myself too. Birdie got a rock in her mouth, he said. <laughs> she tried to kick you in the face. <laughs> She's got your nose. <laughs> I knew her tail would do that. It's, I'm serious. I think they have eyes in their tail. I don't understand it. Because she wasn't looking at it at all, but she knew it was there. Now she'll reach and grab pull herself up by her tail. She was cracking us up this morning with her tail again. She was bucking, trying to uh, catch something up high just with her tail. But I didn't get to film it. It was hilarious when she does that. Because she's just jumping with her back two foot, feet and her back, butt's going up in the air trying to get it with her tail. There's her little tail right there, sticking out. I was gonna touch it. Oh, Lucy's playing again. Put Rooster's hat on. It's not a hat, it's a little water cup. But he acts like he wants it on his head sometimes. Now Birdie's going to get in on the action. Bear's bug hunting. I just heard him. <laughs> yeah, it's been a long time, Danielle. That's awesome. She's safe. Now Birdie's jumping around. Here, Birdie. Go. Go, Birdie. Go. Here she tags you. I've told y'all Birdie's our cautious monkey. She don't like being out in the wide open. So she doesn't play as freely as the others because she's watching around looking for hawks or something to get her. She's the lookout monkey, I think. 
Even right now, she's looking around. Is her eyes red? Or am I just seeing things? <laughs> they look red from here. I don't know if it's allergies or what. <laughs> she says, you better watch it, mister. Let's see. You see if I can see. She's still got her toothpick in her mouth. Oh, it's a clover. Mm -hmm. She's got a clover in her mouth, eating a clover. <laughs> Look at Rooster Kevin. You going night night, Rooster? Just cover him up. Uh, Kale did not catch necessarily with their tail. They can pick things up with just their tail. And carry things with their tail. <laughs> she just done a total backflip. <laughs> a perfect one. <laughs> oh, Lord. I think she might be smoking some monkey grass XX country. <laughs> I don't know what she's doing. Oh, Rooster's walking. <laughs> Are you a circus monkey, Rooster? I hope she stole the cup. She is. She's trying to get somebody to play with her. She says, come on, y'all chase me. I'm being goofy, can't you see? <laughs> You're a tumbling monkey. You're a silly monkey. Oh, I knew that was coming. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. She knocked the camera off. Of the little pedestal thing here I got. Drunk. Yeah. She grabbed it before I could get it away from her. I'm actually surprised they're not messing with this way more. <laughs> we'll just watch Lucy right now. She's putting on the show. Full moon. <laughs> Lucy, Kevin said full moon. Lucy. Lucy. You looking at us upside down? Rooster, you can't do that, buddy. Thank you, Sherry Bell. What is it? That was Birdie. I do too, Marcy. I wish I could bottle it up and sell it. I'd be a millionaire. Really, um, DRJ Spin... <laughs> It's just Lucy that we give kind of a middle name. Um, hers is Lucy Lou. Valerie, he's over in the trees bug hunting. Sue so says Lucy must gut the wacky weed, and then it went off. Hang on. Must get off the wacky weed, and Birdie got. Or must have got the wacky weed, and Birdie got the mellow weed. Yep. <laughs> and then everybody says Bear got some crack. <laughs> Here, help me. He's got my glasses again. I got them. Never mind. Bear. Let's go see what bears are doing. I 
Honestly, though, Kevin has compared it to that since day one. He says that the spider monkeys are marijuana and that bear is methamphetamine. <laughs> if you want a good comparison of the two. I hear him. Oh, he's on the enclosure, Kevin said. I don't see him. Uh, there he is. Kathy, he is. He's such a funny little boy. They all are, really. They are all are just getting funny and funnier as they age and develop. That was Birdie running. Come back over here, Birdie. He says, I want to be in the trees. You're grounded from bug hunting. Uh-oh. Whoa, rooster. Birdie, you coming? Come on. She won't stay because she normally don't do something by herself. Come on, Birdie. I sometimes every now and then you'll hear me say Birdie Lou too. Birdie. She's just sitting on top of that little cage. Birdie, you coming? There she moved. Thank you, Magic Angel. <clears throat> what do you got now, Bear? What have you got now? I can't see. Another tomato? That's like your third tomato, boy. It's your third tomato of the night. He squeezes the juice out, don't you? Well, Danielle, I'm glad you're talking. I'm glad you're commenting and not silent anymore. <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, hang on, let me, my comments on here disappear. Hang on a second, I'm watching them at the moment, then I'll go back and read it. Uh, Grandma Hen, we need to do that now, honestly, but we just have put these other things in front of that. <laughs> Well, we need to do that too. <laughs> we need to mow the yard. There's lots of things we need to do. Um, she's asking when we'll do the emergency tunnel thing to the house. But we do definitely need to do that. I don't even want to think about that. I can't imagine what's going to happen if I'm in the hospital, if he's in the hospital. It's just not going to be fun at all. Whether we had them or not, we don't like being away from each other at all. So none of that's going to be good for nothing. For them, for us. But I know there'll be a time in life that that'll happen. Well... Glasses are fogging up again. Did Birdie come back? Mm -mm. There's Bear. Let's find Birdie now. Birdie. She normally stays somewhere by herself. Are you sure she didn't? No. Well. Is 
she was right up in between the green thing a while ago. See if you see her. Oh, I see her over to the right in the tree. She is being by herself, which is unusual for her. She's in the center of the screen now. We are, Evelyn. Been very blessed in many ways, for sure. Now she's coming down. Thank you, Brittany. Brittany, that's not information that we provide. I'm sorry. I hope you understand. It's just not something we want to promote. She is getting braver, and that's good, because like I said, she was our, she's been the cautious one from the get-go. Took her the longest to ever get down and do things outside. <laughs> she's still flipping. <laughs> she just likes to flip, y'all, I'm telling you. She just likes to flip. <laughs> She needs to be on a show. She needs to have her own show. <laughs> that was like five flips in a row. Six. <laughs> oh, Lucy. You make me happy, girl. Oh, we're going to do it again. Oh, back and forth. Back and forth. <laughs> and again. <laughs> Oh, my Lord. <laughs> Lucy, you are full of it, girl. Kevin, help me here. He snuck up on me. Kevin ain't look being my lookout. Rooster come in from behind. Lucy, you are full of it, girl. There we go. Sorry, she hit it again. Lucy, what are you doing? <laughs> Her legs don't work no more. I think she's malfunctioning. <laughs> Better go recharge the batteries or something. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Send her back to Tuscaloosa. <laughs> oh, Lucy. <laughs> I really hope I can go back and edit some of that and get some of that for the videos. <laughs> That's priceless. <laughs> and she knows we're watching and laughing her too is the funny thing. <laughs> I don't know who to call for a defective monkey. <laughs> No, I think it's what it's called is a happy monkey. I think she's a happy girl. Her flip switch is stuck, they said. <laughs> she don't know where to go in reverse or forward. I have tears. Lucy, come here. Do it again. Lucy, do it again. She says, okay, no problem. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, Kevin. She done it like five times on a row. <laughs> oh, Lucy. <laughs> Look at her, Kevin. Watch. Clean your ears off. <laughs> Something's not right. I'm teasing. <laughs> She's just in a good feel, feeling good. <laughs> She's learned something new. <laughs> Look at her. Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, goodness. Lucy, this may be the best one yet for you. Oh, goodness. What are you doing, birdie? <laughs> She's done got me 
all messed up over here. <laughs> Deborah, that's funny. Kevin, they want to see you do it. <laughs> Look, I think Birdie was trying to do it. Birdie. <laughs> Birdie, now what are you doing? <laughs> now here she comes down the slide backwards. Oh, my glasses are all fogged up because I'm laughing. <laughs> I see you, little girl. Let me pick you up. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. All right, guys, we're tired. We've been on here a while tonight. It's been a fun one, <laughs> for sure. Gave us all a good laugh. Thank y'all so much for joining us. Hope y'all stay on and come back next time. And we hope we see you again soon. Hope y'all have a wonderful night and a great day tomorrow. Tell them bye, Birdie. Look here. Tell them bye-bye. Say so see you guys later. Thanks for being our friends. Say, <laughs> See y'all next time.